Something we all have in this room. Our values. Our conservative values. I believe in some straightforward things. I believe that mindless ideology is dangerous. I'm a pragmatist. I care about what works, not about the purity of any dogma. I believe in fiscal responsibility. Just borrowing more money and stacking up bills for future generations to pay is not just economically irresponsible, it is immoral. Because, because, because it's, the, it's not the state's money, it's your money. So, pragmatism, fiscal responsibility, a belief in work and an unshakable optimism about the future. This is who I am. This is what I stand for. This is what it will take, and we will do whatever it takes. <laughs> and there can be no prosperous future unless it is built on the foundation of strong public finances. I have to be blunt with you. Our recovery comes with a cost. Our national debt is almost 100% of GDP. So we need to fix our public finances. Because strong public finances don't happen by accident. They are a deliberate choice. They are a legacy for future generations and a safeguard against future threats. I'm grateful. We should all be grateful to my predecessors and their 10 years of sound conservative management of our economy. They, they believed in fiscal responsibility. I believe in fiscal responsibility, and everyone in this hall does too. And whilst I know tax rises are unpopular, some will even say unconservative. I'll tell you what is unconservative. Unfunded pledges, reckless borrowing and soaring debt. Anyone who tells you that you can borrow more today and tomorrow will simply sort itself out just doesn't care about the future. So yes, I want tax cuts, but in order to do that, our public finances must be put back on a sustainable footing.